Astrobotic is a company that was built to make space accessible to the world. We're starting with the moon. All the types of things that you would need to build the infrastructure and support the ecosystem on the moon for robotic exploration, for human exploration. We are working to create a lightweight and strong structure that is able to complete the incredibly tough mission of landing on the moon. We want to provide the vehicles and the platforms for people to do science and technology exploration. We work through very rapid iteration and design changes in order to narrow in on a structure that is capable of withstanding the launch environment, the harsh vacuum of space and all of its temperature differences, as well as the actual landing itself. The more you test, the more you have confidence. What people sometimes don't recognize is that once you put the spacecraft on the launch vehicle and put it encapsulate it, you can't touch that vehicle anymore. We use simulation to test and then optimize our design based upon feedback from our simulated models. Because all the things that you can't do with testing, you have to simulate the way the spacecraft operates in space using guidance navigation simulations. And ANSYS is an example, one of the right tools that we've been using for quite a while. ANSYS is a world-class software that has intuitive features that make simulation that talks back to you. It provides you intuition as to how a multi-component structure behaves. ANSYS is a strong solver. It can represent Bavarian dynamic conditions that are beyond the capabilities that you could do by hand. Simulation is really critical for understanding the environments, the stresses, the behaviors of the structure that we are creating. Our use of ANSYS has provided assurance that our design is capable because we've proven it out in the analysis space. Our team uses ANSYS to go from design concepts, resolving extreme load case scenarios, and then modifying the geometry. So ANSYS makes all of those engineering disciplines under one house. I started using ANSYS immediately out of college. So getting to move from that native environment that was the foundation of my own experience helped for a very seamless transition into astrobotic and the work that I do here. We use ANSYS topology optimization tool to refine the design, to use the utility of the ANSYS solver to improve our engineering intuition and to base design modifications based on structurally sound principles that are arrived at through simulated aid that only the ANSYS suite can provide. Astrobotics use of ANSYS has been incredibly valuable and is absolutely essential to the mission. The reality is if we can stick this landing on the first try, I think that opens the solar system up for Astrobotic. Where it ends, who knows?